10k a month. That is something we have all dreamt about at some point. Have you ever wondered what it would be like if you earn over £10,000 every single month? What it would be like if you retired your parents? This is something that we've all thought about. But how? A lot of people have no idea how to even get out of this pit. A lot of us have literally no idea where to start. So I read the book Rich Dad Poor Dad to really understand. And I found out it doesn't start with the money making. That's not how you start to make money or make your own business. It starts with the mindset. <laughs> first things first, how are you? I hope things have been good and I hope things have been all right. After reading the book Rich Dad Poor Dad and actually spending a lot of time in different business models, figuring out what works for me, I found out the biggest thing before you even start to make a business, to start to make more money for yourself. And that is the mindset behind it. A lot of people don't understand the mindset behind business. It's like a whole separate language. The first thing you need to know is the difference between assets and liabilities. You see, a lot of people consider that their assets are the things that they own. You know, oh, what are the assets you have? Oh, my house, I'm renting my house out or my car. But those aren't assets, those are liabilities. An asset is something that puts in money into your account every single month. A liability is something that doesn't, something that can take out money every single month. So assets would be such as real estate, investing into stocks, those are assets. Whereas liabilities is actually your house and your car, things that take out money every single month. Knowing this, now you've understood that assets and liabilities are completely two different things, what assets should you invest into? And that's up to you. You need to spend time figuring out what it is that you want to do. Assets that you can invest into, different business models that can make you passive income monthly. You see, I first started with trading. I started with day trading. I looked into the Forex market. I looked into futures, which is like gold and silver. I looked into a lot of different things such as dropshipping, copywriting, but I've come to YouTube. This is where I'm comfortable with. It's the same thing that you need to do. You need to spend time reading, researching, or the different business models out there, or the different assets that you can invest your time into. The majority of my audience is young. A lot of us want to be able to make 10K a month, but the good thing you have on your side is time. Spend as little as 20 minutes a day just researching, reading about all the different business models out there and which one you want to spend time into and which one works for you. Researching, learning about all you can. Literally, as little as reading two to five pages, 20 minutes a single day, about business, the psychology behind business, about business models that you want to invest in. In a year's time, you will be able to make a business completely with all the knowledge to back you up and successfully. And that's with only just 20 minutes. It's one of the things that's mentioned in the book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, the financial benefit to just information, to just research. It is so important and it's very easy to spend 20 minutes a day reading, but you can do more. You can learn more. Another thing that's mentioned in the book is take calculated risks. Think like an entrepreneur, an employer, rather than an employee. Take calculated risks. It's something I had to come to understand when I was doing trading, because when you trade, you have to do something that's known as risk management. So I don't lose too much money when a trade goes wrong, when a trade doesn't go to how I expect. If you don't do proper risk management, you will lose a lot. However, if you do, you're still taking a risk, but the benefit is far, far greater. And just by thinking, just by starting, that in itself is a risk. Just make sure that you're calculating and managing the risk well, and then start thinking like an employer rather than an employee. When you look around, compared to when I used to, before I even ever started trading or YouTube or dropshipping or copywriting, I used to look around at the world with no value in money. However, after I started learning and researching and actually practicing and doing, I started to look at the world differently. There is money in everything. There are so many things that you can make a source of money from. Even at a young age, maybe you're a teenager, 13 to 18. You know what, mum, I'm gonna do the lawn today, but can I do it for 20, 20 pounds? 20 quid, I'll cut the whole lawn. I'll do this every single week, every single month. There is money in everything. Change the way you think. And then one of the best things that's managed to help me 
is tracking your cash flow. If you think about it, if you just think about the money aspect of your life, how much of it goes out on unnecessary expenses, snacks, things that you don't really need, how much of your money goes to things that genuinely have no purpose in your life, just give you a sort of sense of satisfaction for a brief moment of time. Constantly keep track of it. What I do is I have my banking app as a widget on my phone so I can constantly see my spendings. When you're constantly keeping track of it, it makes you very aware of the things that you are spending on. And it made me stop spending money on things I didn't need. We're going out for a walk, oh, I could go to the shops and buy a bunch of unhealthy snacks I didn't need. Ooh, but do I need it? No. Should I? No. You know what, I'm not going to. I'll go on the walk, but I'll go on the walk to the woods instead. I won't go on the walk to the shops to buy snacks. This is the only way to be stop being broke, and that is start now. Just start now with learning. Change your mindset bah, first. Before you even get into a business, change your mindset because you won't make anything from that business if you don't. I hugely recommend the book Rich Dad Poor Dad. It has so many good things and it goes in so much better depth. And literally just start. As little as 20 pages a day. Buy the book or read it online. Just read it about business, about what you want to invest to, which business model you want to spend time and effort and learn about. And then just learn about it. As little as 20 minutes a day, in a year's time, you will be successful and you won't be broke anymore. I guarantee it. I hope things have been good. I hope you've been alright, and I hope this video helped you out. And I would be really appreciative if you clicked on one that's going to pop up in the corner here, because the video, this, <laughs> this video could help you out as well. And subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Stay consistent and do the best you can. You know what time it is? Oh yeah, come here. Self-improvement kiss. Mwah.